Hello, in this video I want to show you how to set up MX Master 3S by Logitech for the first time. And to do this, in my previous video I shown you how to pair this Logitech to wireless receiver and Logitech Options Plus app. Now it's connected and we can begin the setup. So let's click on the arrow to the right. And here we can set up the pointer speed so we can change the extended sensor range to 8K DPA. This will increase the pointer speed significantly. I mean, it won't increase it unless you change it to 8000. And here, as you can see, it's so fast, but so we're gonna change it a little bit to 1000, maybe 800. You can, it's an option for preference, so choose whichever speed you like. Moving on, we have a scroll wheel button and mode shift top button. With the scroll shift, scroll wheel uh, silently shift from the line by line to hyper fast scroll. Click to the mode shift button to manually toggle between ratchet and free spin modes. So right now I think I have the ratchet and when we click on mode shift, it will change to free spin, yep. Next we can uh, see horizontal scroll thumb wheel and you can choose a function for it to zoom in, zoom out, change the volume and navigate between tabs or add a different keyboard shortcut. So I think I'm gonna go with zoom in and out. Then we have a back button. We can also change the functions for it to make it copy stuff, change volume down, undo for example text or uh, go to the previous page on your browser or also map different keyboard shortcut and I think I'm gonna go with copy then we have a forward button and here again we have a paste a volume up redo or use a keyboard shortcut and since I think I have went for a copy we're gonna go for paste right here is a switch so we can pair your mouse with up to three devices and switch between them with the press of a easy switch button so that means you can connect your mouse with I guess MacBook I'm not sure if we can connect it to the MacBook but we're gonna try later on and then use it on your PC and other MacBook or whichever devices you've connected to gestures so click and hold button as you move the mouse to use the gesture actions below. You can configure the gesture to perform different actions later. So we can hold uh, plus move left to go on the desktop left, hold plus move right to go desktop right, hold plus move up to open start menu, hold plus move down to show and hide a desktop, and we can click to view the task. So you need to press uh, this I'm not sure if I'm recording the... Yeah, okay. So I'm guessing you need to press this gesture button and then use this uh, gestures. Yep, because this locks our mouse as you can see on the desktop and then we can perform one of these uh, gestures and when we click it should open a task view. Yep, it's very nice. So let's move on. And we can set up app specific customization. In this case for Microsoft Edge, if you have more apps uh, installed on your PC, probably you will get more options right here. And I don't want that because I'm not even using Microsoft Edge. So let's disable that and move on. And I think right here we have a setup ready. We can move on. Yep, and there's a mouse configuration where, where we can uh, customize the buttons if we don't like them. And that's it for this video. Hope you like it. Please consider subscribing to our channel, leave a like and a comment below.